In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to set up AirPlay for Windows, which will allow you to view your iPad screen on the PC. First, you are going to need to download the application on your PC. Visit the site www.airserver.com and click on the Download button at the top of the page. In this example, we are going to choose to have a free trial, so click the Free button. A pop-up window will appear, and you'll need to enter your details and click Request Activation. Go to your email inbox and you'll need to open the email from Air Server Support. Click the link in the email and in the new tab that opens, click Download Now. You can also see the activation code here. Copy this to your clipboard, we're going to need it in a moment. Air Server will start a download and when it is finished, click on the file. Click Run in the dialog box that appears. You might need to update your DirectX software, so click Yes. Click Download on the web page that loads and then click No Thanks and Continue. DirectX will start to download. This is quite a large update, so it can take some time. When the download is finished, click on it and click Run in the dialog box that appears. Click Yes and then select a destination where you want to place the extracted files. Here we are just selecting the Downloads folder, then click OK. Wait for the extraction to complete. Now, go to the folder where you extracted the files and locate the file DX Setup and double click on it. Click Yes in the dialog box that appears, then accept the user agreement and click Next twice. DirectX will begin to install and this can take some time. When the installation is complete, click Finish. Now, go back to the download folder and locate the Air Server file and double click on it. Click Run in the dialog box that appears. Click Next, then agree to the terms and click Next three more times. Air Server will begin to install. Click Yes in the dialog box that appears. Click Close and Air Server will start to run. Enter your activation code in the window. We copied this to the clipboard earlier. Click Activate. After a moment, you will be informed that Air Server has been activated then click Close. If a Windows security alert appears, click Allow Access. You will then be told that you need to download something called Bonjour Print Service. Click OK in the dialog box. A web page will load and you need to click Download in the top right of the page. A small file will download and when this is completed, click on it and click Run in the dialog box that appears. Click Next, then accept the terms of the agreement and click Next twice, then click Install. Click Yes in the dialog box that appears. The Print Services program will begin to install. Click Yes in the dialog box again if one appears. Click Finish once the installer is done. Click on the Air Server icon in the Start menu and click OK if there is an error dialog box. Click in the Notifications area and on the Air Server icon. Click Settings, then Rebroadcast in the window that appears. Now you are going to need to go to your Apple device. Here we are using an iPad and bring up the application bar. Swipe to the left and touch the icon, which is a square with an arrow pointing into it. From the option above, touch the name of the computer you want to broadcast to. Touch the mirroring switch to broadcast the iPad screen to the computer. When you now go back to your computer, you will see that the screen has appeared on the desktop and that is how to set up AirPlay for Windows.